yeah so any jumps or something that we do with a tire or burpees we would do with the tire just do them without a tire totally fine to do that okay so we're going to start just by running on the spot so we're going to run and we're going to skip oh actually you guys keep doing that i'm just going to mute you all keep running I've muted you all. Keep jogging. Jog, jog, jog. Jog, jog, jog. Get those legs going. Good, keep going. Okay, so we'll keep jogging. Okay, now turn that into skipping. So pretend you've got skipping rope and get a nice twist if you can. Sort of feet go side to side. Good. Keep jumping, keep going. Feel those calves. My arms aren't really skipping now, they're just going all over the place. Jump to jump. Three, two, one, turn that into high knees. Now I mean high knees. I don't mean just jogging on the spot. I mean bring those knees up nice and high. See my nice straight back. Keep it going, another 15 seconds of this. So your abs start to engage. Good, five, four, three, two, one. And jog. Jog it off. Good stuff. Keep jogging. And after this, now that it's a little bit warmer, we're going to do three exercises three times in a row, 45 seconds each non-stop to all nine in a row. Well, obviously tiny little break in between. Good. So another 10 seconds, maybe you can jump rather than jog. Just get your body moving. Do, do, do. Feel all free. Okay, so three exercises are gonna be side hops, burpees with a big jump so press jump in and then big jump over the tire if you're doing it Laura just jump really far and then we're going straight into side plank so I might do this on my mat we're gonna try this is quite hard side plank high or on your forearm with some leg raises we're gonna try and do 10 leg raises on each side okay so, those three exercises on repeat three times. Ready, we're gonna side hop, like so, to start. Ready, steady, go. We're gonna hop for about 45 seconds. We're gonna do 10 burpees, and we're gonna do 10 leg raises on each side. We're going straight from one into the other. So there's going to be lots of lateral movement today. So like these hops, going to the side. And our side planks. 
and other such things coming up. Good, three, two, one. All right, we're going straight into our burpees with a big jump, 10 of these, okay? So in your own time-ish, I'm gonna count mine and go. So I'm doing a press up as well, and jump, that's one. And two. Three. Four. Five, halfway. Seven, eight, two left, nine, uh, ten, good, they're nice and explosive, so move this back into your side plank, either hold it, We'll try and do the leg raises with me. 10 per side. So, get up. And one, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten. 10. Good. Now you don't have to have your feet up on the tire for this because that does make it quite a lot harder. All right, onto our other side. And one, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine. Uh, 10. Well done. All over again. Into our side hops. Sorry, it's quite a lot of moving, moving around for me for this because I'm trying to stay in the middle. 45 seconds, go. I'm already starting to feel it <laughs> quite a lot in the side of my glutes and thighs, which is exactly what we're after. And stop into our burpees. Uh, one, two, three, four, five, One more. And ten. Well done. And into the side planks. Okay. Get your feet ready. Shoulders stable. Or use your um, arm. Ah, uh, one. Two, 
three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, being wobbly, ten. Good, other side. So again, if this is too much, just hold the plank for the time that I'm doing this. And one, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, and ten. Woo! Good. One more round of that. Into your side hops. About 45 seconds. Ready, and go. Good, another 10 seconds. And stop. And into your burpees. 10 of these. Go. That's one. Two. Three. Four. Five. Six. Seven. One, and ten, well done. Okay, into your side plank. So elevated or not, add the leg raise or just hold. Okay, oh, the floor is so uneven. Okay, and I'm up. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, and ten. Well done. Other way. Get into side height position. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, and ten. Woo! Well done, guys. First round done. <sighs> Have yourself a breather. Get some water. We've got two more sets of those to go, but with different exercises. So this one, we're doing side skaters, burpee lifts, and oblique twists. So side skaters are these ones. So like fast curtsy squats with a jump in between. 45 seconds. Burpee lift, so what we were doing before, but instead of jumping, we're lifting the tire above our head, like so. Laura, you can just jump again, sorry. Or you can do it with your 
weight and do heavy hand burpees. So just press them up to the sky when you come up. And oblique twists, so onto your mat or onto the grass or whatever. And you can either have your feet off the floor, or you can have them on the floor. But the main thing is to look forward. Don't turn your head and neck and shoulders. You want to just be turning the torso and your arms. We're going to touch the ground to the side of us. We're going to do that 40 times, 20 each side. Okay, so 45 seconds, side skaters, uh, 10 burpees, and 40 oblique twists. Three times in a row. Just going to grab another swig of water. It's really hot in the teepee. Oh no, first of all, sorry. We're starting each of these with what we did at the beginning, the run, high knee skipping thing. So we're going to do that again for a couple of minutes, just to get ourselves jumping around a bit more. And then we'll go into three rounds of those, okay? So, 45 seconds, jog on the spot. Well, it's 45-ish. Good, so try and be really loose with your running. We don't need to stiffen up and have like really engaged arms and things like that. I just want you to feel fairly loose. Keep your arms a bit floppy. Get your hips rotating and just generally enjoy it. Okay, we're gonna turn that into our skipping. So, I say skipping, just sort of jump and twist. Get a little bit more loose. The high knees, the ones that aren't as enjoyable. We want to keep heart rate up, but we want to keep muscles and limbs nice and limber. Okay. Let's turn that into high knees and go. So this you are a little bit stiffer, but hopefully you have to limbered up a little bit. This kind of gets your calf muscles quite tense. Your glutes and your back have to work quite hard. Stay nice and straight. And get your arms involved as well. Keep those knees nice and high. Keep going, seven seconds. And stop, jog, or skip, or bounce. Get nice and loose. Oop -a -doop -a -doop. Nice deep breaths. Good, heart rate nice and high. Okay, so we're gonna go into 45 seconds of side skaters. Should I do it here? A bit close, no, that's all right. Ready? Go! So, getting nice and low each side. Bring that leg nice and far back and push off that back leg. Hopefully, your bum is feeling nice and sort of achy already, but achy in a good way. Good, 15 more seconds here. And stop. Let's go into our burpees. So remember, you're going to lift the tire or lift your weights. Or just jump up if you've got none. And go. So, oh, I didn't know why I just put my watch on. We're doing 10 of these. That's one. Two. Three. Four, 
these are a little bit slower with the lifting what well, they are for me <laughs> six seven three more Ooh. eight nine and final one ten hey that was good into your obliques so feet can be on the ground or feet can be off like so remember to keep facing forward and one Twenty. That's forty. If you want to use a weight, I might grab a small kettlebell and do it with that, but you could use anything you've got, a rock or a brick or a dumbbell or any form of weight. I only picked up the 4K. That's not not huge, but it will make a difference. I might put the six in case I wanna push myself a bit further. You don't need a lot of weight for it. Okay, we're going straight back into our side skaters. Ready, 45 seconds, go. So side skaters, burpees, a blue twist. Two more of those. I'm getting quite sweaty. You can see with the breeze from outside. I didn't want my tripod to fall over. And stop. Okay. Ready for our burpee lifts? Ten of these. And go. Or you can just do a burpee. You don't need your tire. You don't want to. Got it does make it a little bit extra using the weight. That's four. Just two more. One left. Good. And down. Okay, into your oblique twists, with or without the weight. Okay. And 
that's naughty. Good stuff. Okay. One more this round. Side gaiters. Ready, go. <clears throat> Twenty seconds left. And stop into the burpees, ready, and go. Into the last few of these. Four left. And three. Two. And last one. Good. And into our repeats. I think this round was a bit harder than the last one. Maybe it's just doing 10 of those burpees in a row. Okay, 40 twists. Ready, go. Eight, six, five, four, three, two, one. Woo! Does make it harder when you add weight. Woo! Well done. That was round two. Not round two, set two. Okay. This round maybe, this last set may be even harder. We will see. So, we do our little running thing in a sec. Oh, hello, Jeffrey. Hello, puppy. Jeffrey's come to say hi. Hey, yeah. Having fun running around. He chased a muntjac this morning. You chased it all over the farm, didn't you? Sorry, Bubs. I do not have any treats for you. Okay, so this one, we're doing the side jumps like we did yesterday. So one foot in the tire, which was yesterday, or was it day four? Or maybe both. One foot in the tire, jump to the side, like so. 45 seconds. Then we're going to do side squat thrust. So I might do it this way to show you. So you're not going to do out and back, we're only going to do side, middle, side, middle. We can do 10 each side. And then we're going to do side plank dips. So again, if you want to do it on the tire, you can, or you can have your feet on the ground. We're gonna get into our side plank and we're gonna do dips like so. Let's do 15 each side. Because keep 10's too easy. We'll see, we'll see by round two if I think that's still the case. So we're gonna start again. 
with our running, skipping, high knees. And then we'll go straight into our three rounds of three. And that's our last one of these guys. After this, we're gonna settle down a bit. And we're just gonna do some arm stuff and some core to finish up. Let me check how we're doing for time, actually. Good. So this will be a night about 10 minutes and then we'll have about 10, 10 minutes for some arms and some core. Not that we're not doing plenty of core as we go, but we'll do a bit more. Do I need these gloves on? Actually, yeah, I'm going to be doing tire touching. They're just very hot and sweaty. I am very hot and sweaty. Okay, side jumps. Why am I putting it over there? Back to the middle. 45 seconds of these. No, gosh, I'm very forgetful, as you guys know. We're doing the running first <laughs> to loosen up. So, it's gonna jog on the spot again. Let those limbs flop about. <sighs> My lower back's hurting quite a lot at the moment, so I quite want to loosen everything up. The more I tense and stiffen, the more it, you know, it hurts, basically. Okay, keep running on the spot. Another 10 seconds here. Okay, and now we're gonna skip. So, do whatever you want in terms of skipping. But basically, just hops like a silly thing. Okay, about another 10 seconds of this, and we're gonna go into the high knees. Solid high knees for 45 seconds. Loosen up those shoulders. Okay. Ready for high knees? And go. Done 20 seconds left. Keep those knees nice and high. Last one we're doing with these. Five, four, three, two, one. Good. And flop about a bit more. About 30 seconds of flopping. Before we get into our last round. So, squeezing my tire. I'm ready for those side jumps. Okay, are we ready? 45 seconds of these horrible things. Why did I add them to this round? Last round. We're all tired. Okay, that's good. Jumping to the side. Lateral movement. And go. So you want to try and get your knees nice and high. So Laura, without the tire, doesn't make any difference, but try and make sure you get those knees nice and high. So that's what the tire does. It just forces us to really lift our feet nice and high off the floor. I'm going quite slow with these because I'm just quite a slow jumper. I like to take my time. If you want to do a bit faster, feel free. Or if you want to go even slower, go slower. Oh, that went very fast. We've got five seconds left. Last hop and stop. All right, so we're only going to 20 of these side jumps, side thrust. Okay, 10 on each side. So get ready. Hands on the tire or just hands on the floor and become as um, 
you know, as wide an angle as you can, as you can get really. Uh, go, one, oh, two, oh no, I'm back to the middle, and three, and four, five, and six, and seven, eight, nine, ten, ten to go, two, three, four, Five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten. Oh, Ooh. feel them in the side of my legs. Okay, side plank dipped. Oh, this is looking a bit hard now, isn't it? My legs are already aching. And this is going to make it. Even worse. Okay, so feet up on your tire or feet on the ground. Come up into your high, uh, side plank and we're going to dip. One, two, three, five, six, eight, nine, ten, twelve, thirteen, fourteen, fifteen. Woo! And turn over. Up on your other side. And one, two, three, four, six, seven, eight, nine, ten, eleven, twelve, fourteen, fifteen. Good. How was that? That wasn't as terrible as I thought it'd be. But we have to got two more of them to go. <sighs> okay. So, side jumps. At least there's only three in each round. It goes fairly quickly. Ready? And go. Going fifteen seconds. And stop. Okay. Squat thrust to the side. So jump to the side, back to the middle, to the other side. Ten on each side. Are we ready? And one, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten, and ten more. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine. Well done. Only makes me feel a little bit sick. Okay, side dips. Okay, clean position. Ready? Come up. Oh, no, that's my ankle. Come up. One. Four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten, eleven, twelve, thirteen, fourteen, fifteen. Ugh. I find it really tough on my uh, left side, which is good to start on that one. But this one feels easy. Well, easier, not easy. Okay, up and dip. Two, 
three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten, eleven, twelve, thirteen, fourteen, fifteen. Whew. Good work, team. We've got one more round to go. Okay. So, 45 seconds of side jumps. Are we ready? Go. Good, 15 seconds. And stop. Okay. Squat, thrust to the side. We've got just one more of these to go. Okay, are we ready? One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten, and ten to go. One, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten. Final one. Doing so well, team. Okay. Feet stacked. Ready? Uh, one, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten, eleven. 13, 14, 15. Oh, that side hurts. My shoulder more than anything on my left side. I've got a weak shoulder. Okay, on to the other side. And into position. Dip. Two, three, four, five, six, eight, nine, ten, eleven. 12, 30, 14, 15, oh. Wow, my dips got a bit pathetic there by the end. Good work, gang. Oh. Okay. Now we can put our tires to the side. Actually, no, I was going to do shoulder presses with them. You might need your tires. <clears throat> or you can use a weight. But have a little breather. Grab some water. We're just going to do a little bit. Of arms with some boats in there as well. Just got our abs working a bit. So we're going to do press ups, we're going to do shoulder presses, we're going to do tricep dips, and then some boats. So four exercises. Shall we say three times? Shall we see how much time we have? Let's definitely do it twice through. And then I'll check the time. So press ups, just flat on the ground. You can use your tire if you want to. Um, we're gonna just do, we're gonna do, let's do 15 of everything. And then we're gonna go down to 12 and then down to 10. Yeah, that sounds fun. 
So I'm just gonna do 15 normal press-ups this time. I might use my tire for the next one, for some elevation. Might do it on my knees and have some narrower arms, but we'll see. Also tricep dips, you can do them against a bench or on your tire. I'm gonna use a kettlebell and dip the weight behind my head, because I prefer that one. And shoulder presses, yeah, use the tire if you want to, or you can use a weight um, of, of any kind. You can use a baby or a chair or whatever you've got lying around the house, really. I don't think any of you've got a baby lying around the house. It's quite fun doing that with some of my clients who do bring their kids. It's babies weigh a lot. Okay. I'm just blabbling, guys, because uh, I'm feeling quite tired and I don't want to do 15 press-ups. But we're going to do it. We're going to do it together. Okay. I'm going to count mine. If you want to get your own pace, that is totally fine. I'll probably stop being able to breathe by 10. Okay. Ready? And go. One. Two. Three. Four. Five. Six. Seven, eight, nine, ten, eleven, twelve, thirteen, fourteen, and fifteen. Whew, well done. Shoulder presses. Just fifteen. Just fifteen. I think two is enough at the moment. We've all done so much. Okay, go. One, two, three, four, five. Oh God, my arms are dead. Six, seven, eight, nine, ten. Oh my God, five more. Five, four, three, two, one. Wow. I'm going to blame that on the fact that I've got a really heavy tire. Whew. Into our tricep dips. So, against a tire or a bench or with a weight behind your head. And go. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine. 11, 12, 13, 14, 15. Oh, okay. Boats, boats, boats. Oh, why did I say three rounds? We're almost there, guys. I'm like doing things in threes today. Okay. Uh, one, two. Three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten, thirteen, fourteen, fifteen. Well done. Two more rounds. 12 and then 10 and then I'm gonna let you go home oh wait we are home okay I may have to uh, skip the stretching because not skip it I want you all to do it I've got a PT client at one so let's go straight into that okay and then we've got, right, we've got five minutes let's do some press-ups 12 of these. And go. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten, eleven, <laughs> twelve. Oh, my last few were quite pathetic, and I. Definitely didn't get as low down that round, but hey, 
still doing it. Okay. Shoulder presses. Ready. One, two, six. <laughs> I'm having a little pause. So my last thing I had to do pushes with, with my knees, because I think my arms have given up. Okay. 12 tricep dips. Ready, and go. Nine, ten, eleven, and twelve. Oh, Jesus. <sighs> Sorry for all the blasphemy. Okay. And into our boats. Ready? Good work, team. We got one more round. Just 10 of everything. 40 reps, and then you're done. Totally done. Okay, 10 press ups. 10 press. Um, shoulder press. 10 tricep dips. 10 boats. Okay, am I going to be able to do these on my knee, on my feet? We'll see. Uh, guys I feel like my triceps are gonna fall off okay presses and go one two three four five six seven eight nine ten ah. Two more. Ties it dips and boats. Ready. And yeah, this is horrible. <laughs> Who is that? Becky. Yeah, Becky. I've uh, I regretted this entire thing probably about four minutes into the workout. I'm finding it hard, so I really hope the rest of you are. Last one though. Ten. Nine. Eight. Seven, six, five, four, three, two, one. Oh, tricep dips done. Boats. Just ten boats, guys. That's all we got left. Okay. One, two, three, four, five. Six, seven, nine, and ten. We're done. We're done. Oh. Oh.